how to build an automatic bone mill farm. These are the resources you will need for this farm. Okay guys, so to start off with, we will need to build a automatic redstone clock. So to do that, place a block right here, another temporary block on top of that, then one block right here, and another block behind that block, and then destroy the middle block. So now you should have a little V-shape like this. Then place a redstone comparator, sorry, repeater facing into that block, and to the block that's kind of, you know, the opposite block, place a redstone, to redstone torch right under, and after you place a redstone torch, the redstone repeater should activate. Then on the other side right here, place a redstone dust, and now this should flick on and off like this. So when this is flicking on and off and everything is right, you can place a lever on the front right here and activate it, and this should all stop. Okay guys, so after you build this from the redstone dust, you want to go one block out and one block up, and place a block right here, and from this block, place three more blocks going out, so one, two, three. You should now have a line of four blocks. So after you've done this, place four sticky pistons on top of here. After you place this, you can head behind here and place four blocks behind the car, you know, bottom blocks and head back in front here and the block where the redstone repeater is on place four more blocks going out from that block so one two three four then head behind here again and connect up the pistons to this activated redstone dust so place two redstone dusts right here and four more on top of here so now the pistons should be activated just like this so now what you will need to do is place four sands on top of these blocks and four sands on top of the pistons just like that and then what you can do is build a two block high kind of wall above the back pistons okay guys so you will We'll also need to place four blocks right here and along with that just kind of make all kind of block in this little area just like this so the main part of the farm is going to be on top of here so just make sure you you know build a little wall around so after you've done this you need to place four normal pistons on top of here and after you've done that you can just block up a little wall following up here and this wall will need to go one more block going out so you can just head down here and place blocks up to make it look nice just follow blocks on top of here so the farm should look like this so far okay guys so the next step is to make the collecting system and the kind of bone mill making system so to do that place two double chests right here or more if you have making this farm bigger you can also make it smaller that's up to you so behind the chests place hoppers going into each chest then four composters on top of each hopper or one composter of per one hopper then on top of each composter place another hopper facing into each compost then what you'll need to do is build this little wall one block higher up going all around here You can also block off this little area with a wall Okay guys, so the next step is to place eight glass pla panes or just, you know, glass panes right here After you've done that you can place a stone slab or any kind of slab in this corner Then simply water block that slab and then place hoppers, sorry I mean trap doors on the top rest of the kind of opening here And then what you'll need to do is water block the rest of the hoppers, sorry trap doors then after you've done this you can place your kelp on top of each of the sand blocks and then just get out of this little room. Okay guys, so after you've gotten out there you will need to head to the right side and expand uh, the kind of, you know, platform right here by one block. So you will need to have a minimum of a 3x3 three three area, which we do have right here because I expanded this out. Then what you will need to do is place four repeaters in kind of a redstone clock circle like this. So place a repeater right here, take it onto two ticks, repeater right here, one, two tick, repeater right here, one, two tick, repeater right here and one two tick or three ticks however you would tick it but just make sure that the repeaters are kind of right but you know right next to hitting the last kind of you know part of the repeater uh, so yeah then what you can do is link up all this with the redstone then go behind here and place four blocks behind the other pistons and just connect this up with redstone dust just like this you need to get rid of this cow but now guys the farm is pretty much done so all you will need to do is simply just kind of get this redstone activated so to do that place down the lever activate it once and then destroy it quickly and this will start to go around in circle and as you see the pistons right here will activate and then this activate so after this has happened head down here and flick this lever and now as you see the kind of kelp will start to grow super fast because of a little glitch in minecraft and the kelp that is spawning will hit it will hit the glass panes which will be sent into the hoppers and after they reach the hoppers they will fall into the composters which will then be turned into bone mill okay guys as you see we already have some bone mill this farm is pretty quickly and i would recommend you build this a little bigger because you know the bigger the better now i have made another tutorial about this which is this the same farm but it's double as big so i might recommend you check that out instead but still it's pretty easy to expand it uh, but yeah this is the farm guys and i hope you enjoyed it so hopefully now you will be able to get all the bone meat you will ever need and yeah so anyways thanks so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace out